<laughs> so I didn't buy. Not. I don't make purchases without. I was about to say. <laughs> I was about to try to catch you or something. You're spending money without my without my say so. Don't don't you dare. <laughs> All right, let's go. It's okay to be racist. As long as you hate on the Caucasians, yep. teaching white kids that their shades the same as school shooters and rapists. Maybe I'm tripping because the white children have been getting taught that they got white privilege by the white guys in the high heels who identify as the white women. I'm not proud to be white, but I'm fine with it because I'm not allowed to Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Dude, hold up, hold I up. already know. Hold up. He said, he said kids are being taught that their skin is bad, that their color is the same. White kids are being taught that their color is the same as. It's okay to hate. It's okay to be racist to white people. Yep. White kids are being taught that their skin's the same as murderers and rapists. Yeah. By white men people. dressed as women. Like, <laughs> <in schools>. um, <laughs> that's facts. Oh my god, that's facts, dude. That's facts. I think this is gonna like. Let's see. This that was gonna, bars. Yeah. And the rhyme scheme. Hold on, what do you say? The lyrics are here, but I think they're wrong already because it's def he said on Caucasian. This says non Caucasian, which would change the entire song. <laughs> Damn, they're trying to put. <laughs> Bro, Yo, this is a this is slander right now. The lyrics say it's okay to be racist as long as you hate non Caucasians. Bro, so it's like just who straight does racism. A Z lyrics? Just straight racism. They're stupid. Just yeah, just yeah. But but see, they're either way, it's it, racist. They probably did it on purpose because he's white. And they're That's like, what he, he can't had make to this said. song. Yeah. Okay. I don't know who because everybody these fucking. It's all a fucking machine. They're all the same. That's yeah, crazy. The rhymes, white kids. Uh, what do you say? He said, he said, hold on. Teaching white kids that their shades the same as school shooters and rapists. Maybe I ain't tripping. Maybe I'm tripping because the white kids. White children. White chi Okay, let's. We gotta go back for a second here. Hopefully they let us. Same as school shooters and rapists. Maybe I'm tripping because the white children have been getting taught that they got white privilege by the white guys in the high heels who identify go. as the white women. I'm not proud to be white, but I'm fine with it because I'm not allowed to have pride in it because the colonizers and the white biggest made white history my business. Uh, I ain't yeah. never gonna give a damn if you like me. I ain't gonna trip when they stereotype me. I'm a white boy and a white boy like me knows that all lives matter. Bite me. Uh, when I was younger, they taught me to never see color to treat every man as if he was my brother. But now that we're grown up, we yep. hate one another for yep. all of the ways that we struggle and suffer. They come for blood and we run it for cover. The government wants us divided and dumb or addicted and drunk in the gutter. So we never wake up and never recover. Bro, yes, yes, yes. This nigga's wild, him, bro. Yes, dude. And that's the thing. That's like, what I was expecting. Like, everybody's, I see a lot of people say, like, oh, it's it's not really like this. Like, that's no, just is. what the media is pushing is like on this. you. This is people saying But, this. like, this is actual, like, it it, it really no, it's is. And it's this. like. There's videos of people, teachers. Literally. People, like, people. They expose themselves. A lot yeah. of people are being quiet about it, but there's people who are saying it straightforward, and then they have to do something about it, so yep. they end up getting suspended or something like that. Yep. But this is a real thing that real people are saying. This Hell isn't just yeah. the media, dude. And it's everywhere. Like just co you'll, little comments, everything. Everybody's always like, it's it's fucking. It really is. That's crazy, bro. That flow is crazy. Yeah, he, he went rhymes in. so much here. Okay, let's try to let's try to let's try to do this. Here. Okay, he said. He said. Actually, I can't do it. He said, I'm not, <laughs> there's no way. <laughs> I'm not proud to be white, but I'm fine with it. Guess I'm not allowed to have pride in it because yep. the colonizers and, and the white, white biggest. biggest made white history my, my business. business. Fucking hard, bro. <sighs> Hell yeah. Which is and then if you say, not really, it shouldn't be that. Literally. Because and if you're you say not that, there. if you say that's not what it is, it's none of my business, it's like, no, it's inherently yeah. inside of you. And you saying this is a part of it. And it's like, bro. It's crazy. And who came so up with that? So crazy. Like, who says that that, that was actually what it was? Where's the research to, like, actually prove any of these claims that, <laughs> like, this is what's really happening? Literally. There's no no accountability for anything. Yep. For yourself in real time, but you're accountable for everything that happened before you. Yep. But in real, in right now, you don't have to be accountable for anything that you do. Mm -hmm. If you are, in, if you belong to a certain group. But Crazy. you have to be responsible for everything that happened before you if you're white. Yeah. Wild. And then it's like, okay, so then if I have to be responsible for everything that white people do, you have to be res you're responsible for everything that black people do, right? Don't you dare say that. <laughs> so Don't everything, you dare everything say that every like bad that. thing that a black person does, it's on it's on you too. Yeah, but that's what that's what they say the media does, and then they say that's wrong with that when that Isn't happens. That, yeah. When they lump all black people because together. Because it's false. It's that's bad. so far from the truth. But it's not far it's the exact same thing. But yeah. the total opposite meaning when it comes to the two different, it's it's so crazy. But you know how it goes. Hold on here. I don't know why that's doing that. But you know how it goes. Mm. That's, that's you know, 
rules for thee, but not for me. <laughs> yeah. That's what it is. Yeah. That's crazy. That's wild. But hold on. So then he went into, uh, I ain't going to trip when they stereotype me because I'm a white boy. And a white boy like me knows that all lives matter. Bite me. Fuck yeah. I know that too. I remember when that used to bother me. All lives matter? Yeah. Before like before I before we even started YouTube, remember before, <laughs> before I even, when I still was BLM supporting yeah. and anti-Trump. And then without, basically, like without any type of, any type of prompt, I just started looking for the opposite argument. You know what made me want to get the opposite argument? Because I wanted to stop losing arguments that I was making pro BLM and pro yeah. all this bullshit that was happening, anti-Trump. I wanted to win those arguments, so then I started going to the opposite side, watching Crowder and Shapiro yeah, and them. Like, which and then me, you realize. Yeah. And I was like, damn, a lot of my arguments are based in emotion. There's no facts to back up anything I'm saying. Which is why I keep losing yeah. if you're that type of person. Yep, but that is, like, so rare for people to actually uh, look inward and do that. Mm -hmm. It's so rare. Uh, when I was younger, they taught me to never see color, to treat every man as if he was my brother. But now that we're grown up, we hate one another for all the ways that we struggled and suffer. Th and that's facts, too. Yep. Like, I, I always say that. I'm from where we're from. I know white kids going through worse than what I'm, what I, how I yeah. grew up. Uh -huh. Like I had a place to stay, even though we got evicted and had, had to move a, b a bunch of times when I was doing drugs. Yeah. I, had, I knew white kids that were going through way worse, mm -hmm. being abused, homeless all the time. Like, yeah. you know, it's I also know black everywhere. kids like that. It's, it's doesn't discriminate. It sure doesn't. Like you could say, oh, statistically it's more this statistically, but I actually in real life know mm -hmm. that there's white people going through the same thing. So they're unrepresented if you try to lump everyone into a group, yep. you know what I mean? Yep. It's crazy. And, and that's like, facts. When we they, were oh, go, go ahead. ahead. <laughs> <laughs> when we were kids, like remember like doing the projects of like all different races, yeah. like holding hands and like making like murals and stuff. Yeah, like they ingrained that. And a now kid is is Martin Luther King. They if a white kid don't wants even, to do Martin yeah. Luther King, he probably can't. Yeah, they probably to. don't even like dude, that's crazy to think about. That's like regression. Is that the word? <clears throat> Regress. I don't Regressed. Know. I don't like, know. I backwards. feel like you just steal words for me. Okay. I'm, not gonna, I'm not gonna tell you what it means. I'm gonna let you let you live with that. You could be wrong. Just know that know that before you say or de progress. That. What? Like progress but backwards. Here we go. That's what it is. Here we go. Here Regression. We go. Regression. That's it. I wasn't saying you're wrong. What I was saying was <laughs> you're just saying things. Okay. That's Whatever. what I'm saying. And then you wanna say, is that what it means? Yeah. I'm not helping you this well, time. It makes sense either After way. After you just so. said everything you just said before this live, before this <laughs> reaction right now. Uh but yeah, I was going to say that it, isn't it wild that the same schools that now want to teach you that skin color does matter was trying to teach us, was teaching us in our generation that skin color didn't matter. Yeah. All these teachers grew up knowing the same thing that we did. <laughs> wild. Yeah. Wild. Tom said regress. Yeah. Let's, let's stop. Thank you. Let's stop I knew here. I was right. <laughs> let's stop here, guys. <laughs> <laughs> let's cut it out. <laughs> let's cut it out, out in the chat. She's let her live in her. In her world of not knowing what things mean, so then she could say a bunch of bad things, a bunch of wrong things. Stupid. Uh, but yeah, that's a wild. That's wild. Mm -hmm. That's wild. Uh, then he said, "They're coming for blood, and we're running for cover. The government wants us divided and dumber, addicted and drunk in the gutters, so we never wake up and recover." That's a fact. It, so we, so we never wake up and never recover, and that is a fact. So true. You, again, personal anecdote, but it's a fact. You come from. A good family. Yeah. Great your, family. Your father, who supported a whole family, has was brought up well, had a brother addicted to drugs. Yeah, overdosed. Like, doesn't discriminate in <clears throat> that family. You turn into a drug addict. Mm -hmm. You meet me from poverty. Yep. I'm a drug addict. Like, it just, nothing, it doesn't it, it, discriminate. It, do, it sure doesn't. They were like, okay, we'll put crack in the black neighborhoods, but then we'll put prescription pills in everybody's <sighs> neighborhood yes. and in everybody's life. Even the people with money, they can, bro, it's so crazy. It's so crazy. It wasn't enough. No. Nope. And it still isn't. It Look it, at what's happening. <laughs> they shifted it to a, it's not anymore a color thing. Now it's a class thing. They yes. shifted it to that. And no, 100%. we just never got out of that mind state. Dude, you walk down the street in any homeless camp, you're going to see and everybody, all types of people, you know? Yeah. It's like that doesn't, mm, mm Nick Johnson said it's Congress. Yeah. <laughs> Congress. Like. 
And then Steph said, but I dig, but I digress. <laughs> okay. So okay, guys. It's one of those. Figure it out. Multiple <laughs> choice. All right, let's continue, guys. Call me culture vulture because I rap good. I don't pop stands or smoke backwoods. But they call me a wigger and label me Hitler and hate like I'm wearing a clan hood. Uh. It ain't left or right or black or white. It's good and evil. I leave folks hate homo people. United we stand and divide and we fall. America, we got to get real. You were segregated. That was not fair. You were this nigga rhyme real, bro. real with, bro, elite folks. This nigga is a real rapper. Hold on here. Let's go back here. Call me a wigger and label me. Call me culture vulture because I rap good. I don't pop stands or smoke backwoods. But they call me a wigger and label me Hitler and hate like I'm wearing a clan hood. It ain't left or right or black or white. It's good and evil. I leave folks hate homo people. You know ah. we stand and divide we fall. America, we got to get real. You were segregated. That was not fair. You were enslaved. They did not care. But you were never on a plantation. And my generation was not there. That's trauma in your DNA. Causing what we see today. I pray to God you staying strong. Don't want to see no man in pain. Your white folks are embarrassed. Some of y'all are such Karens. That prejudice you inherited was racism from your parents. Get that poison out your veins. Whites and blacks are all the same. Yep. They want us in our graves. Just let me try to explain. Come on. I hold up, hold up, hold Dude, up, hold up. Uh, I have chills. That's what I was talking about, bro. <sighs> bro, it's a class thing, but they use race because it's a thing that will never go away until they blend everything, and then it'll be a class thing, and they'll just clamp down on everything. Yeah. But like, prior you, to that, they got to use things like race because until you die, your race doesn't change. Yes. So if they keep you fighting over that, yep. you'll fight forever. Straight the fuck you'll up. You'll waste your entire life focusing Division on it because agenda. it will never change. Mm -hmm. And they'll just keep making money off of you. Oh, ah. Uh, That's why they it's use so things frustrating. Like that. It's they also so use, frustrating. They use gender. They use race. They use things that just can't change. Yeah. And, it's in, and he said there's trauma in your DNA. That could be taken exactly like what I just said. Mm -hmm. Like whites, blacks, no matter what your race is, there's some kind of trauma that is being exploited. Yep. One hundred percent. Because it's like you're you. They make you. All the way down to like, bro, on oh literally every single thing. They, they'll be like, white people can't dance, black people can't. I mean, yeah, white people can't dance, black people can. And then there's white people who kill it dancing, and you're like, oh, you'll never be black. Shut up. Yeah. <laughs> it's just like, for real. Isn't that's that just crazy? like something that you just got to deal with. And that's just, yeah. Like, why do we even care about that? Because clearly, we could all do a lot of things. Dude. I can't dance. You know? Lies. <clears throat> but seriously. It's so, and it's so frustrating because if you speak on this and if you, you could be the most non-confrontational, like most, not, speak nothing but facts and then like, just like make it so understandable. And they're still and like, bro, still, shut up. It's still not that. And it's like. Tom said, it, they use crazy. race, they use race because you can see it. Class is very difficult to pick out of a line. And that's a 100%. fact. We don't even know who has money. We don't yep. know how much money anyone has. We don't know who has money. Like the people who really, really <laughs> make the, the, the decisions with money, no one knows their name. Absolutely. You know, people think they do. Dude. It's but so crazy. But if you know the name, then it's not that person. You know, that person is <sighs> just a puppet for someone else. And the prejudice you inherited was racism for your parents. The immediate thing that I thought of was like, what? I can't read? No. <laughs> I was like, just I did like run through crazy. that, but like, calm down. That's just like so crazy. But it's real because there's racist white people and there's racist black people. Like I told yeah. you, my mother used to be like, don't bring home. home a white girl. Taught in the home. Everything was a race. She Everything was, was blamed on racism. Yeah. When I was in middle school, I was doing that. And mm -hmm. I don't know where I learned that from. Mm -hmm. You know, just being like, oh, you want to kick me out of class because I'm being disruptive? You're racist. Yeah. Automatically. But then you have white people that are growing up fucking talking like crazy to yeah. black people and yeah. other races and like pretty much little, you know, crazy kids running around. But it's like, it's all, it is, it's all taught in the home. It's a fact, man. And well, now it's... Uh, even yeah, if you try to keep it out of your home, it's in everywhere uh, now, everywhere else. Now, if you try to keep it out of your home, you can get your kids taken away. That's what they're yeah, trying to lead yeah, you to. Like, yeah. oh, you don't want you don't want this indoctrination. You don't want to indoctrinate your kids. You don't want to make them a part of the system that we need them to be a part of for us to successfully take everything away from you. Then you Dude. are a bad parent, and you're not helping us. We're taking your kid away, and now we get to turn your kid into a damn. Watch, Whatever they're going to probably make homes, homeschooling illegal or something. At some point. <laughs> yeah. And they're going to blame it on like... It's not allowed because you can't teach it like everybody else. Can. They're going to use the few cases of bad parents. That's yeah. what they do. They take the little and then they're like, that's, a, that's the entire thing, you know? Yeah, that's crazy. That's what they do. Which goes back to what I was saying about 
just uh, uh, them using, oh, all black people this, all white people that. Like, no matter what, they're always just trying to generalize a group. Mm -hmm. So then you can, even if you're not, even if it's not you, when you're not that, you're against the team. Yep. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, if I don't have, if I, I vote for Trump, they're like, oh, you're one of them black people. Yeah. And it's like, I'm still Yeah, black. somebody told me you were exiled from black people yeah. today. And I'm like. Yeah. <laughs> what does that even mean? Okay. What does that even mean? Okay. Come on. Yeah. All right. <laughs> like, what does that even mean? My skin's still black. <laughs> no matter where real. I go. <laughs> like, <laughs> regardless of where I go, I'm like, still oh, black. No. You know what I mean? It doesn't make any sense. All right. Whites and blacks are all the same. They want us in our graves. Just let me try to explain. I swear they want us in a race for dying every day for whose lives matter more. Uh, Whoa, I won't be dying in the race for our government is paid for. Cause our lives matter more. Mm. Shot over your shoes, you gon' get killed by police even when you follow the rules. If you listen to the news, you gon' believe all this is true. true I was about to say, okay, he came in real woke with that one, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I, was like, I was like, okay, I don't know what's going on here. Let's see what's happening here. I, I was I was questioning, I'm not gonna lie, I was judging him for a second there. I was like, okay, I don't know what kind of pandering this is that he's about to try to do. <laughs> <laughs> and then, oh, just kidding. <laughs> but then, yeah, if you watch the news, that's exactly what you what you'll believe, and that's a fact. That's a fact. He he did that right. Mm -hmm. He came in on that right. Hell yeah. If you born black, you lose. Might as well go get that. You gon' die before you twenty five. Get shot over your shoes. You gon' get killed by police even when you follow the rules. If you listen to the news, you gon' believe all this is true. True. I ain't feel no white guilt. Don't lie for me when Fuck. I'm killed. I guess white lies don't matter. Sad, but that's the way that. I I feel like they feel like like I don't know what they all call me Cis white male bigot racist he's a Nazi okay. That's not me I'm not one of these white liberal commies yep. You think black America needs allies and they are yep. Your neighborhoods all gay and claim you pro-black But you faking guys are dying on the pavement All your hashtags won't save them that ain't gangsters uh. Bro, all facts Fucking all right facts. Fucking Let's go right. through this Let's go through this because he just went crazy mm -hmm. Okay so he said if you're born black, you lose. Might as well go get that noose, it says, or ooze. Uh, he said noose, right? Yeah, and they, Basically, white people are going to hang you. Everyone, Every white person hates you. Everyone's a clan member. Yeah, That's yeah. not you. Okay. Okay. Yeah. You're going to die before you're 25, get shot over your shoes. You're going to get killed by police, get killed by police, even when you follow the rules. If you listen to the news, you're going to believe all this is true. And all this is facts because, well, it's not facts. What he's saying is facts. Because I used to think that. Remember, mm -hmm. I used to be like, damn, I'm not going to make it to 30. I used to think that all the time. Dude, you used to say it, and I used to be like, shut up. Like, I used to shut think that up. all used the to time. used to say it all the time. Every birthday, up, up. And it's like, it's crazy. But then, I'm 34 now, <laughs> and none of this has happened. Yep. I get stopped by police. They don't even give me tickets. They're like, oh, we'll let you go this time. Look what happened. You fucking... Crawled out of hell, dude. For real. Like, and, and that's, that's something that they want to tell you be, you can't do. Yeah, exactly. You can't do that unless you focus on race. Yeah. Focusing on race is the only way out, which actually implies that you're not in control. You have to stop someone else's actions in order for you yep. to progress, which is crazy because there's plenty of black people who are progressing in this fucking country. The most black millionaires, I always say this, yep. countries made more black millionaires than anyone else, yet it's the most racist country somehow. Straight up. Doesn't make any sense. Black families have generational wealth now in this country. Plenty. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Because they figured out what works for them. Yep. You know? But it is what it is. And it's like, they act like it's a race thing, but, bro, what you do is what you do. You know what I'm saying? How you think is how you think. If you really want to get ahead, you will. Mm hmm You know? You ain't got to sell yourself. You ain't got to do nothing yep. like that. It's personal. It's instead, all personal. People like to be victims. Straight up. You know? But yeah, that was bars. Hold on. What else he say here? <clears throat> he said... I ain't feeling no white guilt. They don't write for me when I'm killed. They don't ride for me when I'm killed. I guess white lies. What did I say? Oh, that's not what it said. Hold up. Let's go back here. Not me. I'm not one with they all news. You gon' believe all this shit, but that's the way that I I guess the white lives don't matter. Not, it's sad, but yeah. I guess that's just how yeah. I feel. Okay. Okie dokie. I see what's going on here. I These people can't. 
hear. <laughs> Whoever yeah, wrote these AC lyrics. lyrics is tripping. Yeah, they can't hear. Okay. Uh, but that's the way that I feel, and that's what they'll tell you. That's what I hear. And anytime I say anything against it, like, why? Yo, I've had people say crazy things. Not, it's not like very common because mm-hmm. I think people get the energy that I don't care yep. because I don't. You know, a lot of these people saying these things have never been through anything in their life, which is why that's what they're focused on. Because in reality, you know, that's not the important part. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? There's nothing like that. Nothing about race that will, like, yeah. somehow just make your life better. Just focusing <laughs> on it. It's not, if anything, you're just going to be, you're going to be able to be controlled whenever whoever wants to control the narrative, whoever is controlling you're the narrative, wasting your time. tells you where to aim it. Yeah. You're wasting so much That's that a, you could be doing with your life. Uh, what's his name? Bo- uh, is it Booker T. Washington? I think he said yeah. something like that. Focusing on race is mm. definitely the way. To, it's it's created by the exact people you're talking about, like the yep. elites. This shit, that that type of shit, is created by these people because they know it'll keep you keep you down. <clears throat> uh, what does it say? Uh, I feel like they. I feel like. I feel like they feel like, I don't know what they call me, cis, white, male, bigot, racist, he's a Nazi. I've seen these words more times than ever in the past five years. Uh, <laughs> that's right. not me. I'm not one of these white liberal commies who think black Americans need allies in their army. That's another thing. That's, what do they call it? They call that soft, uh, s- uh, the soft racism of expectations. Like black people can't handle themselves, so they need okay. the savior. Yeah. They, they have such low expectations of black people that they think they yeah. need to step in. They can't and go help black and people, get IDs, like which that. is condescending and insulting. And that's like national. Yeah, that's like they they black they, people don't have internet. Is yeah, what they say things like that. <laughs> AKA they're savages. Yeah, black like, people are savages who don't know how to use the internet. <laughs> what are you trying to say? They can't go to the store you know and get. They can't go get a license. Your like, whole family is like, "Can you help me on the computer?" Yeah, for real. Everyone I know is like, "Can you help me?" I don't know what I'm doing on the computer. That's can like, you help me? Every white person that I'm close to. That is so crazy. Yeah. Like, talk about blatant disrespect in your face, and people just give it. To, come on, I need more. I need yeah. more. That's sick. But. That's then sick. you go in, like you've seen these videos where these people will go, they'll ask all the white people around, they'll be like, do you think black people, da 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 voter ID is racist, da 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 and all these white people be like, yes, 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 yes. Then they ask 10 black people, and they're all like, no, it's not racist. Yeah. <laughs> like, what, what do you mean? Please, I make work, us use IDs. Make I everybody. do everything I can yeah. to, to make my family live, uh, make life better for my Safe. family. Like, we need all this. We need mm-hmm. all these things that you're trying to so claim disrespectful. are unnecessary and are racist. Yeah. But that's how they do it. That's insane. It's wild. Yep. That's why they teach it young. And then this goes to BLM. Basically, the BLM conversation that I that made me really stop paying attention to BLM was your neighbor, your neighborhood, uh, your neighborhood talk. Anything? I don't know. Hold on. I actually, I have to go back here. I feel like they feel like like I don't know what they y'all call me. Oh. Sis- Your neighborhood's all gated, Gang. claim you gated. What'd you gated? Ba- yeah, what were you about to say? Gangin. Gated. Gangin. <laughs> oh, maybe he said gangin. No, I don't know. But I think he's, I think he means celebrity, but it could be your neighborhood's all gangin too. But I think he said gated. You claim that you're pro, pro-black, but you're faking. Yeah. Because guys are dying on the pavement. All your hashtags won't save them. That ain't gangsta. So all these celebrities who ride for the side would never be seen in, their in these own. same neighborhoods that they're claiming are like being oppressed when yeah. they're being oppressed by ourselves. Like Quavo going with yeah. the gun violence. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I think he said gated because BLM, the leader of BLM has Is bought, a bought million houses mansions. with that. Yeah, makes sense. Bought houses with the money from BLM. Yeah. So hashtag and let's BLM hashtag, let's do all these things. Yeah, and say none their of it name. Is doing anything. Yeah, yes, this okay. is their name. Yeah. You know, they're fake. Black out your, they're fake pro black. I get it. it. Yeah, that's what it all is. It's just Absolutely. a way for them to exploit, which makes them worse than anybody they're talking about because you're exploiting your own people and trying to keep your people held back, knowing that you're profiting off it and they're not actually believing anything you're saying. Yeah. That's yeah. like it's the same thing. The the pro black, like the uh, the is it Tariq Nasheed? These people. Oh, we're gonna start the school and do that. Take all this money. Don't do anything. All mm-hmm. that shit are just as bad as the rappers who are perpetuating violence, violence, kill each other, I hate nigga shit type shit. You know? Straight up. But yeah, bars. Black 
That was prolific. Every, every color color turns to bones when you bury them. Fucking. Everybody bleeds red. Yep. Everybody's the same bones, bro. Dude. Same color bones. This that shit was, is. That this prolific. is epic. I'm not gonna lie. <clears throat> Goodness. This is like fucking dope. I ain't pro white. I'm pro American. Every color turns to bones one day when you bury them. Whites and blacks are all the same. They want us in that grave. Just let me try to explain. Uh. I swear they want us in a race for dying every day for whose lives matter more. Uh. against them but it's you against me ain't nobody gonna win everybody gonna see that the okay color of your skin don't change the color that you bleed uh, I, I just said let's go bro he was singing yeah hell yeah When you, when you sing facts like that, that's how you get it in your head. That's yes. how you get it in people's heads. Yep. Hell yeah. It's really culture. That's really the thing that shifts everything. They'll tell you that rap is crap and all this da 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 da, but it's culture that sh that shifts everything. There's more like conservative young young men in America, young people in America. Mm -hmm. I've seen it more and more. On that, there was a page. Uh, that page on Instagram is called Rap. Just rap. That's the name of the page. Yes, I think and I follow them. they post like pictures of things. And uh, <laughs> they posted today that somewhere in California wants to give illegal immigrants the right to vote. Yeah. And you would think on a rap page, it would be a bunch of good. Blah, blah, blah. And it was all like, what the fuck? What are you doing? Like yes. stupid ass Democrat. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. That's what it was. All the comments. Yep. That's like shade room and shit. People are getting more and more. It's like I... I've I remember from the day Biden became president, mm -hmm. I've been commenting on Shade Room, like just trying to just see what people be saying because people are seriously crazy out here. Yeah. And it the change, it's really it really is changing. You can see a difference. People are waking up, people are like this Even is built bu bullshit. Both sides are trash, but what it took for me to realize that was for me to get away from the echo chamber I was in. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like you gotta you gotta see the scale. Cause like that, waking up on that, and sh and then you'll realize, oh, it's all bullshit. Yeah, that's you what know? happens. Absolutely, that's literally what happens. Love y'all. This is an epic reaction. Back to work for me. Appreciate y'all to the moon. Adios, guys. Appreciate you, man. Dude, Thank we you, love man. you too. Amazing. And I'll hit you up today. I want to see this. I want to see this video. We're gonna this, react to it live. Dude, for sure. Hell yeah. This Fire was song. Amazing. Amanda said, "Powerful." That's exactly. Absolutely. Yep. This is what they do on these albums, bro. This is what they do. Fire. That was lit. That was lit, lit, lit. Yeah, that was dope. Bro, always starts the conversation mm -hmm. every time. That's important. I could have kept talking, but I'm like, I got to keep it short. Yeah. But I could have kept talking, could have kept talking. That is important. Fire.